Just recently, the James Webb Space Telescope announced its incredible triumph, a breathtaking high-resolution picture revealing the utter majesty in the celestial realms. Yes, the telescope just announced first-ever, real image of another world. This is a fantastic advancement in our understanding of the universe. Want to know what showed up? Let's find out. Numerous space exploration tools have been developed throughout history, but none have achieved the scientific breakthroughs that the James Webb Telescope has brought forth. This telescope was actually designed to go back to the beginning of the universe, and it has succeeded in doing just that. The sharpest photographs has been obtained, and it completely alters everything. Using NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers have captured the first direct image of a planet outside of our solar system. Because the exoplanet is a gas giant and lacks a rocky surface, it is inhospitable to life. The image, as seen through four different light filters, demonstrates how Webb's strong infrared vision can readily capture worlds outside of our solar system, paving the door for upcoming observations that will provide more data about exoplanets than has ever been available. The James Webb Space Telescope is a technological marvel created to see the universe in unprecedented detail. It is sometimes described as NASA's most ambitious project. It was launched in December 2021 and set out towards its objective, which was located around 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. Its main goal is to explore the depths of space and discover the mysteries there. The moment that the telescope's modern equipment finally captured an image that defied the limits of our imagination finally came after months of waiting. The James Webb Telescope focused with painstaking accuracy on a faraway exoplanet located in a distant star system light years from our own. This is a transformative moment, not only for Webb, but also for astronomy generally, said Sasha Hinckley, associate professor of physics and astronomy at the University of Exeter in the United Kingdom who led these observations with a large international collaboration. The HIP 65426b exoplanet in Webb's image has a mass that ranges from 6 to 12 times that of Jupiter, and these observations may assist to further refine that range. In comparison to our 4.5 billion-year-old Earth, it is a young planet, being just roughly 15 to 20 million years old. Short infrared light waves were used to capture photographs of the planet that were taken in 2017 by astronomers using the SPHERE instrument on the Very Large Telescope of the European Southern Observatory in Chile. The intrinsic infrared glow of Earth's atmosphere prevents ground-based telescopes from picking up additional details, which Webb's perspective at longer infrared wavelengths reveals. The information gathered from these observations has been analyzed by researchers who are currently writing a report that will be submitted to journals for peer review. In contrast, future opportunities for researching far-off planets are already hinted at by Webb's initial exoplanet capture. HIP 65426b is sufficiently far away from its host star for Webb to be able to distinguish the planet from the star in the image since it is 100 times further away from its host star than Earth is from the Sun. Webb can directly observe some exoplanets like this one since its near-infrared camera and mid-infrared instrument are both fitted with coronagraph, which are little masks that block out starlight. This decade's end will see the launch of NASA's Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope, which will showcase an even more sophisticated coronagraph. The efficiency with which the Webb coronagraph suppressed the host star's light was really impressive, according to Hinckley. Because stars are so much brighter than planets, it is difficult to take direct photographs of exoplanets. In the mid-infrared and near-infrared spectrum, the planet HIP 65426b is a few thousand times fainter than its host star. The planet appears as a slightly different shaped blob of light in each filter image, this is due to how Webb's optical system specifically converts light through the various optics. Finding this image was like searching for hidden interstellar gold. The only thing NASA scientists initially saw was starlight, but with meticulous image processing, they were able to sift through that light and find the planet. HIP 65426b marks the way forward for Webb's exoplanet exploration. Even though this is not the first direct image of an exoplanet to be taken from space, the Hubble Space Telescope has already captured direct planetary photographs. The fact that they have only just begun is what NASA employees find to be the most fascinating. There will be a ton more photos of exoplanets that will influence how we see their physics, chemistry, and formation in general. We might even find worlds that weren't known to exist. This complicated device has four scientific equipment, 
So taking images with it is very different from simply pointing a smartphone at the sky and pressing a button. A final image only appears after several weeks of processing mountains of data. When the numbers are written down, they don't resemble a stunning color visual at all. They barely resemble anything at all. The first exoplanet spectra or study of a planet's atmosphere using the telescope will be presented according to NASA officials. Astronomers may learn in great detail about the types of molecules that are present in an atmosphere thanks to the light data. The European Space Agency, Canadian Space Agency, and NASA are working together on the Webb mission, which will study some of the oldest, weakest light in the cosmos. A time frame fewer than 300 million years after the Big Bang, when many of the first stars and galaxies were created, will be studied by the powerful telescope. It will also be used by scientists to look inside the atmospheres of other planets. Discoveries of substances like water and methane, which are essential to life, may signal possible habitability or biological activity. According to astronomers, Webb will usher in a golden era for cosmological comprehension. The selection of this first crop of cosmic imaging targets was made to showcase the telescope's capabilities, but NASA remains tight-lipped about what else is coming. What do they mean by the deepest photo yet? Here is what we know yet. The Hubble Space Telescope's ultra-deep field survey, taken nearly 20 years ago, must be surpassed if the Webb image is to travel deeper than anything humans have hitherto seen. Nearly 10,000 galaxies in all different ages, sizes, shapes, and colors may be seen in the iconic, vast photograph. Because light and other types of radiation take longer to reach us, astronomers who look farther can observe the past. The earliest galaxies that can be seen in Hubble's deep field date from the first 800 million years following the Big Bang. In comparison to the universe's estimated age of 13.8 billion years, that time frame is incredibly young. However, Webb was designed to view even further back in time. Its primary mirror is much larger than Hubble's, measuring 21 feet in diameter as opposed to just under 8 feet, and it uses infrared wavelengths to detect invisible light. In summary, there is a lot of dust and gas in space that blocks our view of really far-off, naturally faint light sources, yet infrared radiation can get through the clouds. According to a web scientist, the telescope is so sensitive that it may pick up a bumblebee's heat on the moon. This accomplishment's importance cannot be emphasized. Astronomers and scientists have access to a lot of data because to Webb's capacity to take pictures of other celestial bodies with such clarity and accuracy. It offers a special window into the wonders of the universe and enables us to look into the depths of the cosmos like never before. The birth and evolution of galaxies, stars, and planetary systems are among the main objectives of the James Webb Space Telescope. Webb aids in our understanding of the processes that shape these cosmic bodies by obtaining photographs of far-off planets. The telescope's cutting-edge technology and capacity to deliver on its scientific promises are demonstrated by the discovery of the first actual image of an alien world. In addition to giving us a visual picture of a far-off planet, Webb's image also sheds light on its atmospheric makeup, surface characteristics, and perhaps even any indications of habitability. We can determine the existence of specific gases like oxygen or methane, which may be a sign of biological activity by analyzing the makeup of other planetary atmospheres. These discoveries may advance our knowledge of the possibility of life beyond Earth and aid in the ongoing quest for extraterrestrial life. We can anticipate further cosmic discoveries as Webb continues to collect data and take pictures of far-off worlds we will gain more understanding of the universe and get closer to finding the answers to long-standing concerns about our place in the cosmos with each new image and discovery. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get the latest insights from this world and beyond. There is still more to be done and we must keep pushing for expeditions in order to learn about our universe more and more. If you want to learn something else about the James Webb Telescope, click on the video links on your screens to watch our other videos in a similar domain.